The New Country 96.3 Second 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 Date Update We got Rick standing by Rick had a great first date with Melanie but no second date we're going to see we're going to help him out this morning so first of all Rick tell us how you met Melanie uh, First of all it's, it's, it's Dick You keep calling me Rick but it's Dick Oh, I'm. You know what? I, I I guess I read that wrong. I'm sorry. Okay, uh, Dick. Okay, it was my grandfather's name. And it means a lot to me. So. Dick, cool. Dick. Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. So uh, so Dick, tell us how you met uh, Melanie. I first noticed her on Instagram. I started liking her pictures, and you know, I got on the DM and asked her out for drinks. So eventually, she came out, and you know, we went to get drinks, and it was a good time. How long before you started liking her pictures and sending her DMs before you guys went out? Oh, I want to say about a month, a month and a half. Okay, so there was a bit of talking. There was a good bit of talking. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, and how did your date go? It was awesome. I had such a good time. But you're calling us, so are we correct in assuming there was no second date? No, she never talked to me again. I got completely ghosted. All right, well, let's have us give her a call, see if we can figure out what's going on, and see if we can get you a second date, okay? All right, cool. Hello? Hi, is this Melanie? Uh, yeah, this is Melanie. Hey, this is the Hawkeye in the Morning Show on New Country 96.3. Can we talk to you on the air for a second? Wait. <laughs> Why? Well, that's a good question. Uh, we have a feature on our show called Second Date Update. And people call us not a great first date, but for some reason never progresses to a second date. And we got a call about you. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay. Is it okay if we talk to you on the air? Okay, yeah. Now I want to know who called about me. <laughs> Do you remember going out with Dick? Oh, yeah. I did go out with Dick. <laughs> well, he said you guys had a great first date, then he said he never heard from you after that. Yeah. That's true. He's right. I mean, don't judge me, but I we did have a good date. We did. He's a nice guy. He's fine. I didn't know him before we went out. We just met on Instagram. We were just talking, and we were chatting a lot, and he goes by the the name Country Boy something, some number. Oh, on Instagram? And, uh, yeah, on Instagram. So, like, that's all I knew him as. And then finally, when we decided to actually meet up, he sent me a DM and was like, oh, by the way, my name is Dick. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. I'm a child. And uh, I was like, no, it's not. <laughs> and uh, he said, yeah, it was like his, um, he's named after somebody, somebody in his family. And uh, I just... We, I couldn't. I can't. I can't. I thought he was joking. It's really his name. I can't meet. Ma- ma- I can't date a guy named Dick. So let me ask you this: When did you find out he wasn't joking? Was it before you guys met, or was it like you still assumed he was joking when you guys met for the drink? I assumed he was joking when I when we met up. I thought he was going to be like, ha ha ha, you know, like just kidding. I was trying to be cute, but no, no. He reiterated that that is his real name. Well, here's the deal. He asked us to call on his behalf. He's actually on the other line. Can we bring him in on this conversation? Oh, God. Um, okay. All right. Hey, Melanie. Hi, Melanie. Hi. I told you it was my grandfather's name, and it means the world to me. I know. I know. I'm sorry. I'm sure Grandpa was a really great guy. You're just being shallow. No, I, I don't think so. I, I think that you have to... Remember what day and age we are in now. That word means something else, you know? I don't know. I can't I can't imagine being like, I'm in love with Dick to all my friends. <laughs> What's wrong with that? I'm sorry. I I you know, honestly, with Dick <laughs> sorry. I think that maybe you should think about changing your name or going by like a nickname, like maybe your middle name. What's That's your middle just name? Maybe ridiculous. Not. That'd be like me telling you to change your name to Nancy because I like it better. I mean... If my name was... I wouldn't pick Nancy. All right. Now, how many girls do you know named... But Come on now. Okay, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to jump in here. Um, our whole goal is to see if, if Melanie, if you'd like to go out a second time with Dick. Uh, that's apparently not going to happen. I just... No, I can't. Okay. Sorry. Thank you for coming on the air. I really appreciate your time here this morning. Thanks. Okay. Dick obviously didn't get the answer you're looking for, but at least you got a little closure. I'm going to be perfectly honest with you. This is not the first time I've dealt with this. I could, uh, I totally understand that. 